live streams every Saturday evening. Start times could be from six to eight, so you got time to get there, get your snacks, get your dinner, get a drink, whatever. Come have a good time with me and Qua the One. This channel will be over here. And let's get on with the video. What is up everybody? Okay, so listen, I can explain. I know I've been a horrible hostess. Host, I'm not a woman, host. I've been a horrible host. My last Zach upload was over a month ago, I know. But we back today. I'm here for y'all, don't y'all worry. I ain't forget about y'all. Well, all right, I've been uploading faithfully on my shorts, but my last full length video was literally a month ago today. So here we go. This video is called Don't Make My Mistake, Men. I'm, I got a list of Zach videos to get through for y'all. Make sure y'all subscribe. Hit that bell notification so you know when I drop some more heat for y'all. Thank you, all the new subs, old subs. You know I love y'all. We about to hit 2600. Without further ado, let's get into it, guys. Something happens every single year that I really don't truly understand, but any man out there with a woman, y'all have to go through the same damn shit. Let me tell y'all a little story about what done happened last night, all right? All across the nation, as soon as it rises above 80 degrees, something snaps in your woman's head. They say, holy <laughs> shit, at some point, I'm going to be in a bathing suit this summer. I should go on a diet. Well, I speak for all yep. real men out there. Okay, whatever y'all are seeing in the mirror that's wrong with y'all, y'all are imagining that shit. Y'all are yep. making it up. Women, y'all do yep. that sometimes, if you know what I mean. Y'all don't have anything wrong with y'all. You don't need to lose weight. You need to own your shit. But that's a, I'm going to lose that battle and that war 10 out of 10 times. Well, Sarah done got on this thing where she wanted me to start eating healthier, and she was going to go on a diet to get ready for summer because she's been on my ass about my eating habits. Well, the way I see it is I'd rather enjoy my time here than be for here for a long time and be miserable, but I'm going to lose that war as well. So I say, you know what, baby, let's just go on a diet together. We're going to go ahead and get right, and that way I ain't going to worry about this shit no more. Well, I asked her, I said, what do you need from me? She said, I just need you to support me. I said, baby, I support you in okay. anything you do. Hell, you can't walk through the house right now in a pair of shorts or an oversized t-shirt without giving me a rise in my Levi's. That shit cannot happen. She goes, I know, I just want to feel better about myself. I said, that's fine. You do this shit for you, not for me. I said, now, <laughs> what do you need? She goes, just support. If I try to fall off track, I need you to be stern with me and get me back on track. I said, I'm fucked. That's it, because that shit probably ain't going to go well. <laughs> well, I was right, and she was wrong. Okay, she's been on this diet for about two weeks, and she has been absolutely kicking ass. She has. She ain't ate nothing that tasted worth the fuck. She's got the whole refrigerator absolutely filled up with Tupperware and chicken and vegetables. And she's making these little damn, she saw this shit on TikTok. It's like a little mason jar about that big around, about like that right on. Look like a shot glass. Is it it's overnight oats? overnight oats. Hey. Apparently, you're supposed to eat them in the morning. Well, I'm not a fucking racehorse, okay? I am not Secretariat or Sea Biscuit. All right. And I don't care how many blueberries and strawberries you put in them little mason jars to make them look cute. That shit still tastes like ice. All right, I'm in the South. You better give me some damn cheese grits. Anyway, but I've been eating it because I'm supportive. And I'd do anything in the world for it. But I've been eating this shit. And I ain't ate a damn thing that tasted worth a fucking like two weeks. Anyway, I come in to the house. And she comes in to the house. And I can see her. And she, I know for a fact she ate overnight oats for breakfast. She drank a protein shake for a snack. She ate a Caesar salad for lunch. She ate chicken and peppers for uh, supper. And then all of a sudden, she's in there, and I don't know what happened or what pissed her off, but it wasn't me. And she's in there doing lines on the on the coffee table, not cocaine, just like <laughs> lines of Oreos at a time with hey, ice yo. milk. And I want to get on to her, but at the same time, I like the way my face looks and where I live. So I had to make a conscious decision. I just kind of eased my toe into it. I said, baby, you really think you ought to be eating that? And she looks at me and she goes, you need to love me for who I am and how <laughs> I look. I said, baby, look, I'm just doing exactly what you done told me to do. I ain't want to even do right. this damn diet. We can order pizza and, and molten chocolate lava cake right now. She goes, you just don't need to judge me. I said, baby, I ain't judging you. Ain't nobody judging you. You can walk around here big as a fucking house if you want to. You can get as many dimples on your ass. I can eat fucking cereal out of them. I don't care. You're the one that wanted to do this. She goes, well, we're done now. We're just going to accept each other for how we are. I 
said, that's what we wanted to do in the first place. <laughs> I was already there. But now I had to take this journey of no flavor with you for two weeks. <laughs> Long story short, <laughs> I think we're going on another diet next year because this shit didn't work out real well this time. Uh-huh. This happened to anybody else? Am I the only one? Shit. You are not alone, Zach. You are not alone. I can't say I've been forced into a diet before, but I have been asked to be the supportive partner, which I always am. Always. If you want to do it, you can do it. Ain't, ain't nobody stopping you from doing it but yourself. So if you say you can do it, you can do it. But sometimes, y'all, sometimes women... Y'all don't hear what we're saying until the same words come from y'all lips. And that, the, the, I never got that when we just said it. We may not have said it the way that y'all wanted to hear it, but we basically said the same conclusion. It took you all that extra work to get to. We are simple creatures. We say things for what they are. We love y'all either way to address the other half on the whole reason why they were doing this. We love y'all for the way y'all are. Like Zach said, you get as big as a house. I might make a suggestion, you know, you know, try to preserve your lifespan, you know, so we can live happily ever after. But it's your choice to do what you want to do. I love you regardless. Thank y'all for tuning in. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace out.